At the recent bout where Terence Crawford defeated Israel Madrimov via unanimous decision to claim the WBA junior middleweight title, Shekhar Stevenson and Vasily Lomachenko were both present, leading to an unexpected confrontation between the two fighters. Crawford's victory not only added another title to his impressive resume, making him a four-division champion, but also stirred the pot for future matchups. Stevenson and Lomachenko, who were both in attendance, found themselves at the center of attention following their heated verbal exchange. Stevenson and Lomachenko had previously been linked to a potential fight when both were under the top rank banner. However, the anticipated bout never materialized as Lomachenko opted for a hiatus instead of challenging Stevenson for the vacant WBC belt. This decision fueled speculation that Lomachenko might be avoiding the fight. With Lomachenko's career approaching its twilight years, he has become increasingly selective about his opponents. The confrontation between the two was captured on video, showing the pair being separated by security. In the footage, Stevenson can be heard challenging Lomachenko directly. Me and you, let's fight. Why don't you want to fight me? Lomachenko, unfazed, responded aggressively. We can go right now. Let's do it outside. Let's go right now. Speculation continues to swirl around Lomachenko's future opponents. Recently, Lomachenko was rumored to be in talks for a unification bout against Gervonta Tank Davis. However, Lomachenko's manager, Edges Klimas, has since revealed that Lomachenko is currently uninterested in such a fight due to a lack of motivation and a desire to spend more time with his family. Consequently, Lomachenko will not be returning to the ring until the end of the year. This shift in focus makes Stevenson a leading candidate to face Davis if that bout materializes. Should Stevenson win against Davis, a future unification fight with Lomachenko could be on the horizon, potentially uniting multiple belts in the lightweight division. Bob Arum, a prominent promoter, weighed in on the situation, criticizing Stevenson's perception of fighter autonomy. According to Arum, Stevenson seems to believe that promoters control all fighter decisions, while in reality fighters like Lomachenko and Davis also exert significant control over their careers. Arum emphasized that Lomachenko's independent decision-making is similar to Stevenson's, challenging the notion that fighters are merely puppets of their promoters. The ongoing drama and shifting dynamics in the lightweight division suggests that the anticipated showdown between Stevenson and Lomachenko might become more likely if Stevenson secures a victory over Davis. For now, fans will have to wait and see how the situation unfolds and whether Stevenson and Lomachenko will finally meet in the ring.